Is it true that if a woman maintains either caloric balance with her basically eating enough to support her energy output or even a slight caloric surplus, that it's unlikely that her periods will cease even if she's training very hard and very often? Correct. So it basically boils down to calories in, calories out. Fuel for the task at hand because some people want to have a slight calorie deficit even in high training. And if that deficit is at night away from training, maybe 150 to 200 calories, then it's going to help perpetuate body fat loss, not lean mass loss, and it's not going to interfere with recovery. It's the fueling in around the stress, meaning the exercise stress, it's really important. But women have been so conditioned to not eat and not take up space, to be small, all of these sociocultural things that women are afraid to admit the fact that they want to eat and they should be eating. This is a nuance within the fitness community that we're really trying to change and get the mindset around you train hard, you eat well, and your body responds in kind. 